we're doing our first shopping uh, for the cabin and um, it was expensive but anyways let's just hope when we get there the refrigerator is working and operating well and uh, stay with us because the car is just packed we're just headed uh, from town to the cabin now so we should be there in about a half hour walk with us we are frank and firm with java walker world join us on our journey to quench your thirst for the simple pleasure of a good coffee and explore our magnificent world one step at a time oh my gosh the car is just packed you get all these groceries in here kind of interesting the way the landscape is here with these uh, big hills or mountains I don't know what what constitutes a mountain versus a hill I'm not sure but Atlantic Canada here we are and right beside there is a store called Kent a home improvement store hmm. never been to a Kent store we'll have to check that out while we're here Here we go. We are on our way to our cabin. The yeah. very first moment. We so, are excited. Yeah, we're looking the, for the address. Here. Yes, we're looking for the address. We're trying to narrow it down. It's okay, supposed hold to on, be a few great. more numbers, a few more numbers, hold on, hold on, a few more numbers. No, here we go, we're going in, we're going in, yep, okay, that looks more like it. That looks like the picture. Here's our little cabin. There we go, yeah, that looks like the picture. Oh, how cute. Oh, they left us shovels. Oh, good, you're going to need it. <laughs> we're going to need it with all this snow. so excited it's what we expected lots of snow lots of snow show how high the how? snow is over there it's almost up to the meter box i'm gonna show you a shot of a lot of snow oh, oh still my. here and we're at the end of march yeah and the shed is just buried right up to the oh boy anyway oh my gosh look at there's the electrical meter and the snow is up higher than that holy jamoli rocks to hold the mat down. That doesn't mat. It looks like they left us a couple of chairs and a couple of shovels. Yeah, they need a shovel. <laughs> wow, so cool. Hold on. Oh, all no. keys. Hold on. Hold on. Well, there's the shed. It looks like they got a ladder attached to the shed. I guess it's to try to remove the snow off the shed. I think we're going to have a little bit of repair work to do on that shed, but that's fine with us. Wow, it's so pretty. Yeah, but right now the tree's got to fill in. Wow. Well, I think that shed is pretty big. Yeah, Maybe we'll convert it to a bunkie or get an ATV, something like that, and put it in there. There we go. There we there go. We go. Oh, Frank's fussing with the key. Oh my goodness. Wrong key. <laughs> Wrong key. Wow. Better than I expected. Oh, it smells like a new home. It does. Oh <laughs> it's my got God. that new home smell. The oh, my, my boots. Oh, I had to take my boots off. Hey. How cute is this? They left us all this furniture. Huh. Look at that fairy light. It's kind of cute. Fashionable. Frank's trying to figure out all the lights. Look at that. How 
How sweet is this? Huh. It's just like they had illustrated in the uh, right. MLS. Yeah. They did a good job, exactly, exactly the way they said it. So they left us a couch, which apparently is a, a sofa bed. So how does this work? Hmm, there's a bit of a hole here. I don't know what this is. Maybe it's the cushions. Oh, I see. Well, we'll figure that out. How does this bed work? Oh, it's one of those kind that you pull out. And it looks like they left us a little table. These are all bonus things and a recliner. Hmm, it actually feels like it's a leather recliner. Very cool. And we've got AC for the summer, which I think this is dual. It actually gives us heat as well. Um, although the uh, cabin is um, electric heat so oh they've got it there it's working and it's 19 degrees i see that yeah so it is dual and they left us a little end table oh that's kind of cute a tv with the remotes very cool huh. nice i don't know about you but i'm pretty impressed I'm very happy. Let's take a look at the bedroom. Look at that, they left us a quilt. So it's a tiny little bedroom, which is better than most tiny cabins because sometimes you don't even get a bedroom. Very cool. Very cool. Well, here is the uh, heartbeat of the cottage. Hot water tank, water pump for the well. tucked into a little cabinet or closet. A little closet. Oh look, they left us some more stuff. We'll have to go through all of that. Some pillows. Ugh, I don't know about using somebody else's pillows, but anyway. Oh, and this closet is actually quite deep. You can actually call this a walk-in closet. I can actually walk in. Well, that's better than I expected. I didn't think it was like that. Pretty cool. And the floor is quite warm. Going through the closets, the kitchen cabinets. What did they leave? You said they left the can of sardines for us? Well, they left us some sugar, plastic cups. I see a little bit of utensils. Oh, they left us some wine glasses. A coffee machine and more glasses. Wow. What else? Oh, some bowls, some plates. We brought some, but what's in that little skinny cabinet? Oh, a pantry. Look at that. Oh, sardines for dinner. That's keto. Uh, what's in that little skinny cabinet? Wow. And what's what's in that? Uh, oh, what's that? Tons of bags, and we were thinking we weren't going to have bags. It's nice that they left that. Some cutlery. Oh my goodness. This is all great. Nice. A few things. We'll wash. Yeah, we'll wash all those things. And, uh, it's nice when, when people leave little things like this. You can decide what you don't want. You just just give to charity. Yeah, very cool. And what's in that cabinet? Is that where the electrical panel yeah, is? Yeah, that's cool. Look at that too. So they've got the electrical panel. It's a big panel too. Wow. In this cabinet, and then you can just use the sides to hang things and do little stuff like that. And then uh, up on top, what do they have? Extra faucet. An extra. Faucet for the bathroom. That's right, because it's a shower, so soft clothes. Very cool. And pot lights. Oh, you need.
need to show me the bathroom. I'm so excited, as you can tell. So this is the bathroom and laundry room. It's all in one. Bathroom and laundry room. some changes. They left us a few things. Washer and dryer. What a honking washer and dryer for this bathroom. Maybe because you opened the lid? Well, we'll have to get a new, uh, a new mirror for there. in the drawers. There we go, that's brighter. Oh, it does have drawers. Wow, I thought I love drawers and cabinets. Oh, they left us some cleaners and some bleach. And some lights, extra lights. Excellent. And that's where but I like the table better without the tablecloth. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, satisfied, that's for sure. That's the big gosh or golly gee as we came in or, or holy. The agent did a really good job yeah. at not over or underselling the place. Um, he was confident in the whole time we met him this morning yeah. at the Tim's to get the key. And yeah. he said he did not have a problem with this one by not coming and doing a, a pre walkthrough because he knew that the place is only a couple of years old and it showed as it presented itself, yeah. as it looked. There was no hidden uh, stuff. Everything was brand new, two years old. So, uh, yeah. so. we're excited. Now we're gonna start cleaning and out, uh, offloading that yeah. car, uh, which we have tons of stuff, including groceries. Yeah, we brought everything, yeah. and uh, except cleaning. for the kitchen sink. Sometimes I think it's full of <laughs> the kitchen sinks in there. And uh, So keep following us and see how we put this place uh, together uh, in our liking, our way, and uh, yeah, we'll continue with this journey, see how it uh, continues. We'll, we'll make it home. Yeah. See ya. Thanks. Stay tuned. Busy cleaning? Cleaning. Getting rid of, they didn't have a stank, but just cleaning it and putting our stank in it. <laughs> Actually, the uh, cabin was very clean. Oh my, We're just oh my God. doing it again. <laughs> Anyways, just for our own peace of mind and everything looks great. Uh, and our friends Russ and Bruce gave us a ton of stuff to put in the kitchen. Oh, yeah, shout and out to Russ and Bruce. Yeah, we're very, very <laughs> grateful. Here's our view from the bedroom. Beautiful. It's warm out, so things are melting. You can see the drips coming down. And it's a little foggy. Uh, is it about, it's almost 10 in the morning, so we did sleep very well because we slept until 10 in the morning. Yeah. It's April 1st. We've got lots of snow here in the Maritimes.
you making it nice and shiny? Making it shiny. <laughs> Come on. Making it our own. So here we go, dinner. Dinner or lunch? Lunch at 5.40. This is the first meal of the day after doing a few errands. So like uh, my good friend Julia Child says, Bon Appetit! <laughs> then here is Fern's keto plate. And there is Frank's plate that's not so keto. drive to the little town just to the east of us or actually west of us I'm still trying to get uh, oriented here well we're gonna try to pick up some Sunday breakfast at a diner say hello did we order our breakfast Kedgewick Kedgewick a logging town, they have a wood mill that does what, what we see in the driveway, two by four is it, they mill up, so it's a big uh, manufacturing town, so very cool. Yeah, that's for sure. That's what I'm going to do. It's a nine o'clock. Get on the ball, what do you think, they're on vacation or something? Well, as you can see, we're starting to move... Uh, move furniture around, but every day we have to go into town because we have no Wi-Fi. No Wi-Fi. No Wi-Fi, so what do we do? How do we live without any Wi-Fi? I have no idea. To get it here, I have to climb up a big tree and hang on the top of it. Anyways, it's, uh, there's not much we can do outside anyway. We're hoping in the summertime we'll be uh, puttering around outside, uh, which is our favorite thing to do. Uh, <laughs> And um, anyway, so every every day it seems like we're going into town, which is a half hour drive from here. Uh, but from where we used to live when we used to live in the country, it was the same um, the same sort of thing. If we ever wanted to go into town, uh, we'd have to drive about a half hour to go into a bigger city. Um, although Campbellton is not that big, uh, we are getting acquainted with. Uh, Campbellton and uh, what all the services have to and offer. All the nooks and crannies. Yeah. <laughs> One of the things that we're trying to um, accomplish today is to pick up some uh, water test uh, bottles uh, in town so that we can do a water test, uh, although the seller has assured us the water is high quality. So uh, it's just uh, a formality for us so that we feel good about what we're drinking. <laughs> 